So welcome, and today I'm going to be looking at a new ship with Dalmont. This is uh, a rapid departure from what we normally do, in that we're going to look at the interior first. So, yes. show me around, boss. Alright, if you want to grab your gravity. Got it. Uh, it's still a bit of a work in progress. Yeah. We've got, uh, got a couple rooms that are yet to be filled, but this is the main entrance to the ship, which is a little bit different than what I usually do, Ooh. as far as entrances are concerned. Hang on a sec, mate. I think we've got a slight problem here. Yep, draw distance. Okay, continue, mate. I've got it all sorted now. Alright, rock on. Well, we are in the uh, kind of walkway. It's a bit like a... Well, there's probably a word for it, but we're going to call it a walkway. So, this is a little bit different. It's uh, laid out kind of filling up one big area instead of built into the ship in and of itself. Yeah. So I guess this would be the way to start. Head to the, make a beeline to the core room. Now this ship actually doesn't have any weapon systems other than turrets. The turrets are the primary weapon system. In fact, it's not even properly filled with things yet. It's really interesting. There's so much going on in there. So this is the core? Yep. Stats are fairly incomplete, but you can take a look if you want. No, it's okay. I'll wait until it's finished. I've taken all I can do the uh, aesthetics first. I just can't be bothered with uh, filling them up at these, at these uh, paces. So here we go, we're going to come into the first room here. This is, I suppose, a little secretary desk, and we are in the med bay, which all good ships have. Oh, yes. And this, this is now my new favorite med bay. <laughs> There's a lot of detail, that's for sure. It's real nice. Good view of the ship out through the top window there as well. What's this oh, wow. In, what's this in here? Well, did you not even notice that? <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> I put them there and I never bothered to look. <laughs> that looks good. Nice. What's this room here? That is, I guess, either your doctor's office or your isolation ward, depending on who you want to ask. Cool. Same on the other side? On the other side is going to be crew quarters. But it's empty at the moment. Actually, it'd be kind of cool to get a look at the empty room and see the difference. the first time an empty room has sounded interesting. Oh yeah. Still looks good. Good views. Whereabouts did you go? Right in front of you. Nope. Need to find a gravity block. Oh. There's one up here, isn't there? Nope. No? A little storage back there, that's cool. Yep, there's a little, like, room you can go into to check the storage. With the storage actually being the roof. Ah, clever. Let's see, if I get to a gravity block, and I can hit one too. Sometimes that happens. There you go, entered and exited gravity, right. <clears throat> can you see me? Where are you? Right in front of you. That's a no then. Ooh. Come over to this gravity block. Are you using it? Anything? No. Oh, there you are. Right, now in gravity and I can see you. Excellent. Sorted. Right then, which way next? Oh, I think I've managed to leave gravity. Can you still see me? Yeah, you're still there. <laughs> Great. I think one of my uh, another one of my favorite features is those uh, kind of in-wall gardens up above these yeah. two little facilities. No clue what to put in them yet. Hardcore parkour. Oh, oh, where to next, boss? Oh, oh wow. I win this challenge. <laughs> like a champion. Oh! So close. Coming down. 
So yeah, these are basically just empty rooms. They'll be filled with something eventually. Maybe captain's quarters. Neat uh, things from all over. Cool. Oh. And then here we have... Oh, well, I suppose we should hop down here first in the central area. There's a tree. Nice. It's the tree of life. Everyone needs trees. What am I stuck on? I'm stuck on something there. Everyone needs trees. There you go. Good stuff. More trees and ships, better ships. <coughs> Come up above first. Natural a air weird scrubbing. Twist in the orientation. We have a garden, a Zen garden. You'd sit here and meditate upon all the people you've mercilessly slaughtered. <laughs> What's the uh, control thing for? Uh, botany, I guess. At grow some more point. plants. Yeah, there you go. Pop, pop, uh, today pop. I feel like looking at purple flowers. Blink. Ah, uh, very clever. A holographic Zen area. Yeah, I guess. I like it. That's cool. And we'll come down and we will come into the control room. It's a really cool control room, dude. It's really nice. Uh, torture rings. Death magnets. Yeah, death magnets. Oh no, it's even got a room for it. You'd just be like, that's exactly what's <laughs> <for. laughs> <laughs> Excellent, I love it, I love it. And you've got your control room. Big view screen, a map, perhaps. Mm. I figured you need more uh, targeting sensors in this thing since it's a Corvette. Mm. Mm. Lots of turrets and targets on scene. Excellent. But yeah, just looking at all these all these wedges everywhere. It's taken ages to get this looking nice. Nice. I think that's pretty much the interior on this baby, though. At least until I add uh, stuff in the vertical space, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't know. It's kind of cool making it. It's like a chapel or something. It's so cavernous. I hope I've broken up the square a little bit. Yeah. My personal favorite is the uh, SFW logo right oh, above yeah, the corner. Oh, yeah, yeah. That is, that is cool. This whole area here with the uh, diagonal. That's grand. Got a lot of room in here though. Like you say. But then yeah, yeah. Right, okay. So, I guess it's time to check out the outside. I must say that this is one ship I've never been particularly happy with. You reckon? I was trying to do something different, and uh, I don't know if it worked or not. Interesting. Doesn't seem to want to. Oh, right. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Just waiting for my call. Waiting for my call. Can you spawn a core? Oh, it's down here. Uh oh. I think I'm about to get disconnected. No, oh, 12,000 ping. That would have something to do with it. Yeah. Ooh. But I can still record what I'm seeing. So I'm going to slowly pan out. Forty-four thousand ping. Forty-four thousand ping, and look, I'm still oh. able to record. And you're going back down. It's probably going to teleport me back to the ship. I'm moving in astronaut mode. So what's the big turret on the top like? Good. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I think we've seen that one a couple this times. Is just plaster of turrets. I can see why you there are 12 of them? Yeah, I don't know. I can't really count them. I can see one, two, three, four. I can assume that makes... 
nine, eight. And there's probably more. Oh, it's on the 14. Bottom. Oh, right, 15, wow. 16 turrets? Wow. Yeah, 16 I turrets. I can't see them all. Ah, uh, there's the other. There's four more on the inside of these wings. What else have we got? Nice engine design. I don't know why, but I always prefer your diagonal lava designs. You know the bits that you put in between the the engines? All right. They look really fresh from a distance because of the uh, steps. Yeah, this one was intended to be a radical departure from a normal shape, but... I don't quite know if I got there. It kind of is, but it still lo it looks like one of your ships with like outboard engines which enables you to put more turrets on <laughs> uh, that's funny maybe I should cut them off and make a version one no I don't know I don't, well yeah, maybe but it looks fine and it is a radical departure from what you, you usually make just sort of singular I don't know they're not all like that but you can still see it underneath everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's the grey hull? There's a grey hull. Or maybe it's just the angle at which the white hull is right now. Yeah, it probably is. Yeah, it's just the lighting. I thought it was grey. So what's the name of the ship? The Star Dancer. It's beautiful. The ping is stabilised. <laughs> I'm glad to like it. If my ping's stabilized, I'm going to try and get me a core. Any joy? I see core. I see no core. You lie. But then again, I'm I see you, lying. and I see a core. Are you sure? Because I'm and like, your ping's back up. I'm oh. miles away from the ship right now. <laughs> yeah, I see your core. It's right next to you. I'm not there anymore. Oh well. Yeah, hang on. Right then. <clears throat> right, so, I uh, can't wait to see this one finished. So we have finally got those lag issues sorted out, but uh, yeah, it's really impressive. It is very different from your normal style of building. But um, that's not necessarily a bad thing. There's a lot of new. You can see you've tried out a lot of new things on this. Sort of like playing spot the difference. Keep it fresh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it is a bit like because you can see there's little bits and pieces from some of your old ships, and then there's a new design concept for the turret with the inner, using the inner edge. You got like eight of those. Do they not have a problem clipping each other? No. Oh, they do. They do. It looks terrible, but you know what? It works. Yep, it works and it looks cool when it's sitting still. And one day, when the lag issues are totally resolved, I will spawn one of these in as AI and you can watch the wall of AMCs. Oh wow, that sounds like fun. Okay, well thanks for showing me the Star Dancer. Can't wait to see it finished. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you next time.